represent. All right, ready to shop. Ready to shop. It's the costume portion, so I'm just gonna wear like comfy clothes literally. This will be for the writing, because you need a jacket and the colors. I love the car. Let's roll. Since it's freezing, I have to wear gloves and grip a motorcycle. <laughs> I used the one that I got from sale. It's freezing. <laughs> got the lo fi Christmas music on. It's a gorgeous day. Can't tell what it is. They decorated each of the posts to be Christmassy. I don't know if you can tell. Seeing as how it's freaking foggy up in here. I put on the beanie. Look at how beautiful it is outside. Look at that. I love the freaking color. It's like lo-fi beats for days. It matches the lo-fi beats. <laughs> yes. I'm ready for today. So excited. Would you look at that? Morning sunshine. How are you? Look at your sunshine. Aren't you just gorgeous? Not you. <laughs> up in like the mornings more because the view is just great like just look at that the autumn tree view even though it's mid-december it's so gorgeous share the holidays with coca-cola you know what i mean coca-cola and santa so pillars of christmas invention you know what I mean? so beautiful beautiful Oh, there's like no line. Wee hoo. We got the bacon gouda. Honey citrus jade. And the cute holiday cup of stuff. I'm 20 minutes early to class. Excellent. Oh my god. There it is. There's the Harley Davidson. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm in. Okay, we're good. <laughs> the destination is on the right. I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to park. So, I'm going to park. Having motorcycles like this guy, yes. This is correct. This is. Correct! Wow, oh, you guys look so beautiful. You look so beautiful. Oh. Based off of the cars that are parked by me, I'm pretty sure I'm the only girl so far. Will there be other females? Male company's great too. Accessories. They have cute little decorations as well. That's amazing. They have a coffee season sheet. Do they have like hot cocoa? It's the only thing I'll be drinking. Oh my god. The glory. The little sir table thing. Girl, I'm touched. Amazing. I'm excited.
for fill out the paperwork front and back, pull out your e-course, and then... A couple of months ago, I was like... I like the classic look. Iconic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got changed to my jeans, riding boots. Now it's time to make our way to the stadium for the practical driving course. Let's go. Goodbye, Harley dudes. It's been real. I'm not coming back tomorrow. It's actually quite bumping with people now. More cars and stuff. Sun's out more. We're almost there and uh, I'm getting nervous. Like nauseous. Just when you know you're nervous. Mm. Oh Emiliges. Oh Emiliges. Here we are. Okay. We stopped at 440. I'm absolutely knackered. We got out of there at 445-ish. Everyone, the general consensus is going home doing nothing. For me, I'm like, I need a stretch. Wow, my muscles are like tense, especially my left hand with the clutch. I need to build up that strength. <laughs> Good one. I'm tired. Oof. Look at the trees, I look at the trees. I'm beat. I'm exhausted. Someone said, I'm going to go home and do absolutely nothing. I agreed with that sentiment. It's a lot. I'm afraid to take in for one freaking day. Body. Tire. Muscles. Ache. Gonna rest. Shower. Stretch. Eat. Maybe watch something, but probably mostly sleep. straight to the range all day we're doing motorcycle exercises here we go time to go today it's frosted you see the back blasted this on in order to get the front nice and thawed look at that it's just beautiful sunrise Fun fact, these are a brand spanking new pair of glasses and they're transition, like my old pair, uh, which is perfect because <laughs> we don't have visors out there and the glare can can get there once the sun starts setting because we're there for a long time. So yeah, it's a good idea I brought these this time. Huzzah, big brain thinking. In 1,000 feet, turn We're right. back at it again. Hell yeah, uh, slash, I'm fucking nervous. Are there people here? There's the cones. There's the never look the cones. Right there. People. 
people are literally just sitting here in the sun. It's hysterical. I think we're, I'm nervous as heck. We're going to be doing way more things. Mm-hmm. Sorry I'm not recording a lot. They don't allow you to whip that thing out. <laughs> whip your phone out. <clears throat> While you're learning. I'm fucking beat. I can barely speak. I'll try to do it again. Cones. You can see the green. There's also green lines as if it's a racetrack. That was my favorite part. We did that just now. This is from the first day. I ended up not even like eating that much. After that entire morning of exercise drills, we had that break and then we immediately took our five part writing test. I will say each of those parts were way more simpler than everything that we did that day and the day before. So needless to say, everyone passed. Woo! <laughs> so without further ado, here's a certificate review. Why hello there. <laughs> Ta-da! I passed got the entry level course completion finished. And yeah, basically with this, I'm set to go to the driver's license office and register for a class M license. There are other courses available. I will say this definitely was a beginner's class that'll be enough for you to go on the road, but I feel like people should take the intermediate class or practice more on their own or join groups that practice or ride motorcycles we were told by the instructor that there are groups that you could join and stuff for free and i think that's definite because we never really we never rode on the actual streets we did go up to 30 miles per hour and drove around the parking lot but <laughs> being around other cars and going higher than that speed is what we're gonna actually be doing so i feel like everyone should definitely be practicing but this is technically all you need to get a license so i think that people who are taking this course should be wise and realistic we've only were on those bikes for a total of eight hours probably split around the two days and two days of riding a motorcycle is i don't think enough i feel like practice is definitely important your life out there you know <laughs> in cars hmm, i don't know for me definitely i'm gonna practice more but other than that i finally got my bucket list achieved i've always wanted a motorcycle i wanted it when i was like when i was a teen actually yeah so it's been over 10 years and stuff and i finally got it looking forward to the future processes of getting a bike and stuff I got it. Woo.